Samson Sky is a special company and the Switchblade Flying Sports Car is a unique and special vehicle. When we first started out along this adventure, we felt that the future of travel was mostly up in the air. Until then, it had been mostly on the ground. The reality was that for many decades, travel would be increasingly done both on the ground and in the air. That combination would provide faster, easier, less stressful, and more enjoyable travel for business and pleasure. We want to put the fun back in travel. That is the adventure we're proposing for you. I don't know anyone today who feels that regional travel shouldn't be improved. For those travelers facing the delays, cancellations, or poor connections and schedules for regional flights, it's a recurring drudgery of getting up in the wee hours of the morning or traveling until nearly midnight or even early the next morning. And that is if there aren't any hiccups along the way that cause an extra day of travel. For those who choose to drive those regional trips of 200 to 500 miles, it is the wear of a long drive and the potential for delays due to road construction and congested cities along the route. The Switchblade Flying Sports Car solves these problems by providing relatively low cost form of door-to-door -door regional transportation. You keep the vehicle in your garage rather than pay a thousand per month for a hangar. From there, you drive the vehicle to the closest airport, convert from ground vehicle to flight vehicle in three minutes, at the push of a button, I might add, and fly to the airport closest to where you want to be. Then it is a simple three minute conversion back to ground mode for the final drive to your destination. No waiting for rental cars, no hassle from the TSA, no schedule that you have to meet. Total freedom of travel, significant savings of time, and with reasonable costs involved. Many people ask, why not do this as a vertical takeoff and landing or veto vehicle? Isn't that the future? That is definitely a part of the future, but not for those who want to travel far and fast. If you want to go up to 500 miles and 160 miles per hour, then the Switchblade is the only vehicle that can do it. If you want to go from a downtown heliport to an airport, then the VTOL is the way to go. The VTOL vehicles can only operate out of airports or heliports. They can't get to your brother's house in the suburbs or an office downtown or a special restaurant or theater. We can. The VTOLs can't do what we can do, and we can't do what the VTOL can. They are different vehicles for different purposes. Our purpose is to increase the freedom and speed of regional travel and put the fun back in travel for business or pleasure. So let's look at some examples to help paint this picture. Say you lived in St. Petersburg, Florida, and you want to visit someone in Miami. By car, that's a four hour drive. There is no commercial air service from St. Petersburg, but you could take a 30 minute drive to Tampa and fly to Miami airport, and then take an Uber to your final destination. With the parking at Tampa, check-in procedures, boarding, the flight there, and then getting an Uber ride somewhere in Miami, you might spend almost three hours. So three and a half hours using a commercial flight route. The Switchblade takes you door to door from your home to the final destination in one and a half hours. Another example might be San Jose to Lake Tahoe for the weekend. Driving is easily four hours with light or no traffic. Near the weekend, you might expect medium heavy traffic and add another 20 minutes to that on both ends. So that really is gonna be a nearly five hour trip. There's no commercial air service available, so not an option. With a switchblade, that is a one and a half hour fly drive. Bypassing traffic, tolls, bad drivers. You just took seven hours out of travel and put that time back into your weekend fun. Say you live in Boston and have business in Philadelphia that is a must to attend. Driving that trip is nearly five hours in good traffic. You have many flight options that will make the trip in an hour and a half, but then you have to drive to the airport, park, get checked in through TSA, take the flight, get off in Philadelphia and get an Uber or taxi to your destination. That whole process could take three and a half to four hours. In a switchblade, that same trip could take one hour, 40 minutes on your schedule, not the airlines, and you never leave the vehicle. We find it on average that you can save half the time of travel using a switchblade. Often it is much more than that, as you don't have the travel on the circuitous routes that roads dictate. My wife and I love to go to a hot spring just south of Tahoe. It takes nearly six hours to drive there from our house in Northern California, but it is only a 45 minute flight. The difference is that the route there is insane on the ground. In the air, it's a breeze as you travel in a straight line and we can have a wonderful weekend at the hot springs 
without spending most of that time in the car. This is an example of not only saving time, but arriving at your destination refreshed and in good spirits. After all, you just got up in the sky and looked down at tremendously beautiful vistas in all directions as you traveled with scarcely any traffic to worry about. If you talk to any pilot, the best part of the trip is the flight, where you are above it all and seeing the world from a unique and wonderful perspective. It can put the spring back in your step and be a way to clear your mind. This is the adventure I mentioned at the beginning. It is for you that we worked these many years to develop a vehicle that is capable of improving your lifestyle so greatly. It is up to you to take advantage of it. From one pilot to another, I wish you blue skies.